Hello, welcome to the Drone and Dad Show. Hi. Today we have um, another really awesome set of pop models. We have set. The entire set of the brand new Candyland pop models. Candyland. From the game. A game we all Candyland. play. And also, um, there's a couple exclusives in the set that I saw also that we don't have. They are ones that I wanted out of the set, but we don't have the exclusives. We just have all just the normal common ones. But the exclusives in the set, there were, I think, two exclusives. There was a Target exclusive, which was Lord Licorice. Whoa. So if we ever get him, we'll for sure do a show on him. And... Another exclusive was, it was, I think, a Funko Shop exclusive. It was a shared exclusive with the Funko Shop. It came out around the same time as the Underdog pop model, and it was Plumpy from Candyland. Those two aren't Plumpy. on the box, because they're exclusive. So there's two exclusives, and there's, there's five in the set, and we have the five. Yeah, but if we ever get the <clears throat> exclusives, I don't know if we will or not. I do want them, but if we ever get the exclusives, <clears throat> not positive we will or not, but if we do... I'll for sure do a show with them, for sure. I'll okay. include them in a previous show. So who do we, we have, have here? We have the Queen. We have Jolly from Candyland. Queen, Queen Frostine. Frostine. We have Mr. Mint. King Candy, which is like probably the most... King Candy! King Candy, the most detailed one of all. I like with him. With the most detail. These Candyland pieces are very then, involved, intricate, interesting. And then a lot the hardest detail. one to find out of the entire set that was super oh! rare. The player piece. Red player piece. Now, fun fact. My dad and I actually went on a pop vinyl hunt. We did. First one in a long time. And... We actually found this. My dad found it hiding on the back of a shelf. At GameStop. is like somebody had maybe put it there in a discreet location for later. And I thought, you know, they were maybe saving that for themselves, but they didn't pay for it. So it was on the shelf. So I took it. And we bought it and paid for it. Yep. And another cool detail is that I wanted to show off is on the little oh, oh, oh. flaps. There's gum it's drop. On, it's on the gum top drop and the pass. Bottom. See on the bottom right there it says gum drop pass. You have to turn it upside down so they can read it. Yeah. Gum, gum drop, drop. You know pass. gum drop pass where you get to like s skip ahead in Candyland. I always love landing on that. And then on the top it says gooey gum drop. Stay here until a yellow card is drawn. That is interesting. And that was on the box for, who's it on? Um, who's that? Jolly. Jolly. There He's got he a is. fancy wreath, big eyes, holding stuff in his hand. Pretty cute. He's on the Candyland board, too. All these things are and from the And his game. head obviously can't turn because he's all one piece, so you'd have to turn He's all out. head. Head but. bones connected to the backbone, connected to the booty bone. Right. Now I'm also opening up Mr. Mint. I think he had a stand too. Oh, okay. Well, here you can show him off. I'll I'll retrieve the stand, and I'll show how it doesn't have words. There should have been a stand. It fell out somewhere. It fell out. Fell out right here. Ah. There we go. We found it. Mr. Mint has the deal on the tag, and it doesn't have words. It has. Can we yeah, guess? Anybody guess space. what it is? Like the the space cane. from the game, this, and it's a space with a candy, candy cane on it. Mr. Mint yep. space. There you go. Yep. Mr. Mint's got a little flag. He's all pepperminted up. Peppermint hat, peppermint sleeves. I don't know if that's a flag or a Peppermint hat. tights. It's, it's, it's something that he's got in his hand. I don't really know what. It looks like a flag. It might be. I don't really know. Could be a mask yeah. nowadays, I guess. Nowadays he could be carrying around his mask. And then he's got this hat on, this big tall hair. Cute. Now his head turns a little, not very much though. Did we ever kind play Candy Land? Because we still play it sometimes. Did we ever play Candy Land with these as our game pieces? Because that would be fun. Hmm. Maybe we should do that tomorrow. I don't know. 
I don't think I have school tomorrow, so I'd be no. free. The whole Tomorrow's day. Friday. Maybe. Free all day. Anybody want to play some Candyland? Hit us up. Maybe we can. It's going to be a pretty day. Maybe we'll play Candyland at the park with the gooses and the ducks. And the duck, duck gooses. Here is. There she is. Frostine. She's okay. blue. She kind of reminds me of Elsa. She's a blue queen. She's got a pretty dress. And obviously a freeze wand. Free. Free. Her wand is super fragile, so you have to be careful with that. She would be cool if her head thing, if her crown, if it lit up. Burp. I'd like that. And there's the top of the box that has the space on the board with the little snow fuzz. The Which bottom didn't have anything. Queen Frostine. It's just that. But I think that's cool. I think they have that on all the boxes I noticed once I'd gotten them. And I think that's a pretty cool detail. This guy's heavy. And, uh... Her head can turn just a little, but not a lot, because the little lawn gets in the way. I'm going to save the player piece for last. My dad's... King Candy is thing. heavy. Yep. Like, he's like heavy like the Hulk Buster. Really heavy. And that plastic snaps So heavy, together. he's got a different kind of a... His even plastic is almost kind of like a, a 10 inch would be. Yeah, Show how big he is. Together. He's very dun, full. Dun, 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 dun. Charge! I got to snap together. So why is he so heavy? What's all? What else he got on him? He's got this like really tall hat. His hat's like a cupcake of sorts, and he's got pink mustache. He looks like uh, Preston played a guy in a play at Emerald Little Theater that looked like that. Professor Sweet Tooth or something with the I don't remember. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory, I think. You got the big pink cape, a little bit of blue on the inside. It's kind of hard to see, but there's a little blue on the inside of his cape. The big white collar, pink mustache. This one's got this is really a whole lot of detail. Heavy. He came fragile with a stand. and heavy. He doesn't need the doesn't stand. Doesn't need the stand, but he has the stand. But he came with one in case. In case he were to fall. And we looked several places, and we didn't think we were going to find the red player piece. And then we found, hidden yeah. in the back at a GameStop, turned around backwards, someone had put him there. Probably yeah. with the hopes that they would come back and buy him. But we bought him done. first. Okay. Sorry sorry if we, like, snarfed your, you know, player piece, but, you know. Yep. First come, first serve. Yep. And... I think Mom and I actually looked this pop vinyl up. We actually looked it up right before you and I got on that pop vinyl hunt. Mom yeah. and I looked that one up, and it said it wasn't even out yet until, like, I don't remember, like, when February we found it. or something. What's well, yeah, a good we find? Went that. We went on that pop vinyl hunt, I think, around, like, January. Did I put that back in backwards? Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, you put it in backwards. Well, I don't always get it right. I'm not the expert. Oh, also, I forgot to show this off on King Candy. On his box, it says win. Win. For the win. And another cool thing is on the side of the box, it has the little different colored squares, like, on the board. So, like, those are the little squares. Win. And on the player piece, it says start. With a little at the start. At the start. And then you win at the end. Finish. Yep. And at these the end guys. At the end. And these guys, I think I actually got for Valentine's Day a while back in February. It's already April now, but it was, I think, like back in February is whenever I got these guys. Because um, Mom, I think you and Mom got them for me. But the only one we didn't have yet was the player piece. But now we finally got them. And there he is. Hello. And, surprisingly, his head actually can still turn. I didn't really know well, if it would or not because he's, he's kind of flat. flat. He kind of reminds me a little bit of the like gingerbread Mickey and Minnie Mouse. Yeah, they're, that's, they're, that's, they're about they're like that. that. Agreed. Yeah, this one's kind of flat like them. So that's the Candyland set, 20 seconds. Yep. But, please like and subscribe. Until next time. Bye. Bye. <laughs>